What is going on guys? Welcome back. Now today I thought it would have been pretty neat to do life 25 tsdg also second channel is gonna li be linked down below also if you need help with uh even lower life tsdg um i do tsdg carries um every once in a while so if you want help getting tsdg sent uh pretty much any of that hop in the discord below um it'll be in the description and make sure to sub we're almost at 4k so that'll be really cool uh that'll be really cool if i actually hit 4k um but you know it is what it is now let's go ahead and show you everything that's down right now so these are all of the reborn items that we could get before life 25 or 25 um they aren't too rare besides butterfly being honest with you um and then you just need enough money to make a loop with these and then i'm just gonna put a conveyor it needs to be a slow conveyor like reasonably slow actually what if we put okay so another way we could build this is let's get some ramps let's get some plasma and some military grade conveyors how about that that'll be pretty Pretty pog worthy, I'd say. Alright, now, if I decide to do something like this, no, that's not gonna work. Unless we remove this, but I definitely don't wanna just like cut it off because that might cause issues later on. Or, ooh, even better, what we could do is we could get a conveyor. Let's put this here. Let's get some centering conveyors. I'm going to need a lot more than this. Alright, now we're going to get some wall segments. Put these right here. Also, wait, let's look at Reborn Mines really quick. Um, actually, you know what, we're either way, at the end of the day, we're still gonna use Newtonium. Oh my god, thank you. It's low enough life. That is so good. Okay. Now, what I'm going to do is this. Let's get a reversible conveyor. Now, we're actually going to build this BBB loop correctly this time. So, we're going to get conveyors out. Actually, no, we should probably get our receiver over here. Got to conserve space, my guy. And then right here, we'll put this plasma and then actually we could probably just put a ramp another ramp here just in case then we're gonna need to go in here look up gate we're gonna buy a lot of these and then Full sized. Shit. Where's the lucky crate? Oh, it's not here. Okay. So, honestly, this shouldn't be too bad to make. Like, being realistic here. Shouldn't be too bad.
Now we could get a plasma conveyor right here. And then we're going to need... Hmm... You know what? This side might be the best for this. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna do that. Let's get gate. And then we need to buy some walls. By the way, the only reason I have these walls around the base is for cutting out executive, because I'm pretty sure that's the correct size. Alright, um, what's a good wall? Alright, then we're gonna get a... segment over here. And then, I guess we could probably just do... this. Right now, um, what we're gonna do is we're gonna put... like spiking probably because I'm doing this in a public server which I'm not gonna stay in um so we're gonna get a reversible conveyor here needs to go this way then we need a spore here perfect now what we could do instead is this now these are fast conveyors it's very trustworthy um so i'm not like thinking this is gonna fail at least because of that but i also want walls here just to be like extra safe because our blaster luck needs to be god tier, probably, as it is. Um... We're gonna get a ramp right here and right here. We're gonna need insane luck. Alright, I'm gonna switch to a private server. probably gonna divide this up like in a little bits and pieces spread throughout the day because I know I don't feel like sitting here right now and hoping for super good blaster luck now all right um oh that saves that's actually really neat I wonder if those save with layouts too Alright, now, what I think we need to do is start working on the actual setup. So, time to start buying shit. Now, first off, you need to buy a lot of teleporters, as many as you can. You'll only be able to buy two types. That's the concerning part. And now, then... Let's see what we're going to need. We're definitely going to need loop-de-loops. Of 
cryogenic upgraders, aerogel refiners, propulsion devices, mini upgraders, and toxic Schrodingers. Then we'll need nuclear chambers or magmafiers. What else could we use? Hold on one second. All right, so as it seems, Rotary Upgrader is a life one item you could buy. So we're probably gonna include that. Now, what else could we use? We could use, oh, easily, easily orbital upgraders. Um, ion fields. Drone upgraders, I don't think are allowed. Let me check. I don't think it's a high enough. Um, I think it's like a high rebirth item. So we're gonna buy some flaming um, ore scanners. We could also buy some. Oh, definitely an ore tracker. That'll come in handy. Uh, I guess ore steamer would be really good of an idea. Plasma iron polishers would be great. Shielded conveyors too. Um, 30 of these, uh, the portables. I don't know, I think that's pretty much it. Unless there's something I'm missing, but I think we'll be all right. All right, now I guess it's time to go into the hell of creating this setup. I keep looking at the wrong webcam because I have two webcams and I am really getting tired of it. You'll probably see me do that a lot throughout this video, but yeah. All right, now what we're gonna do is we're gonna make this setup and yeah. Alrighty, let's do this. So, move all this crap over here. And to begin. Now, pink teleporter right here. Alrighty, now we are going to start off strong. We're going to get an ore cannon. And we want to make sure this will work. So we are going to get Newtonium right above. Just like this. We're going to get our Vortex Chamber. Alright, that, that works, I'd say. That definitely works. And we're going to get a Big Bertha. Alright, this will work. Yes. Okay, thank god. Now, just to be sure, what I like to do is get some pink teleporters all around this, just in case. And then we're gonna get ions. Because ions are good. Gotta hope those hit. Now, yeah, this isn't too too hard to make work. Now, 
as far as I could tell, drone upgrader is allowed. Actually, I did some more research into it, but I'm not too sure. Let me know down in the comments. Um, you'll just need more blaster luck if it's not. Um, also, I noticed in my life's 75 tutorial, um, like a week ago I noticed this, that I used welders, and those are like 175, so I kind of screwed up there, and I apologize for that. Um, but yeah, this is definitely doable. Um, either way, it's just going to be really, really hard. Now, I think it would be neat to put some reborn items starting here. So, I'm going to put a tracker, actually, because I want to make sure everything's working as it should, you know, all of that good stuff. That alone is bringing it to trillions. Oh my god, okay. So this is good so far, I like this. Now, I think I should put a centering conveyor here, just because I know it's going to be a pain in the ass if I don't. Also, FNAF stream, later today, probably. Um, I think I'm just gonna upload my Let's Plays here and just upload random content on my second channel. I don't really know, um, but either way, MH content, it's just kind of dry right now. Um, it's just grinding, really, but there's not much to grind for, unless you really, really care about Chinese. But other than that, it's just grinding, and I don't know. Alright, um... But yeah, uh, expect a shit ton of content whenever the new update drops. Now, we're gonna do that. Let's get some of these. Actually, this would be pretty neat. I think this is a good spot for these. Okay. Holy crap, what is this name even letting me place? Alright, so let's get... I, I'd say about four of those. Three, four of those. Four. Looked like three for a second. Um, what was I trying to do earlier? I had a really nice idea for something. Okay, let's put a pizza blaster for now. That should be fine. Let's get all like those upgraders out of the way, I guess. Um, we've used vortex, mineral wheel, pizza. Oh, we can use clockwork. What else could we use? Could use a lightning bolt. That's what I wanted to do. So the first one's gonna go here. Oh, there's still one there. Um, oh, and we used Big Bertha. No, honestly, I need to. I need to think of something for loop to loop on how we're gonna get this to work. Um, if anything, actually, best bet is putting it like right here, as it seems. So we'll do something like that. Um, oh, I have an idea. Let me check something. Alright, so Spectral Upgrader is a life 10, so we're allowed to use this. Um, and Overhang, I'm pretty sure. Overhang is a life 5. Okay, so we could use this too. Um, also, I have a really good idea for something. Now, what we're gonna do here is large conveyor wrap. It's not even the converter, just that. Oh, and the converter, actually, later on. And probably some elevators. I don't know why I'm just now getting to this. Alright. I don't think optic origin is a very good idea. What did I have with draw? Oh, lightning bolt. Okay. Okay. So, what I wanted to do is... Portable flame barrier. ramp you gotta find something to fill up some space really quick
Actually, this is probably good. Um, let's just get two tiny conveyors. Then, actually, if I do this and put spectral, and then yes, that works. Freon. Alright, that works. Actually, just to be on the safe side, I'm probably just gonna put that here. And then... Alright, so this is looking good so far, I'd say. I want to save space. That works. Alright, alright, now... What I could do is... Um... Ooh, this is gonna be tough. This is gonna be tough, and I know it will. Let's get some scanners. Um, let's put two, just in case. Ancient temple. Does it times five now? Oh my god. That's really good. Catalyst. Now, the sawmill. I mean. I don't know. Honestly, this is very, very risky. Nah, we're not gonna use sawmill. It's worth the extra ore to some extent. Quantum ore cleaner. Wild Spore, and then Azure. Then we're gonna get a Converter. Shit. We could put one of those later, honestly. How does this thing work? I've never actually used this. I'm gonna... See what this does really fast. Shit. It has a very slow conveyor. So what we're gonna do is move all this here. Just like that. And then we could put the rotary upgrader in. Oh my god, you're kidding me. Okay. 
There we go. That's probably a little bit better because it does get more speed, I guess. So now, what we're gonna do is see how this works. Okay. So they just drop in and hope to get hit, I guess. Okay, so there's two upgrade beams on there. Um, what's the multiplier, though? Because I can't tell. Um, let me look up. Rotary upgrader. Times four if they are able to hit the upgrade beam. Okay, so that's pretty reasonable. I'd say that's worth it. And then we have to try to implement loop-to-loop -loop here because it's like the best spot for it. Oh, thank God. Okay. They don't really die too often. That's risky, but this item itself is always risky. I was up to like seven in the morning. All right. Um, give me a second. I gotta do something real quick. All right. So I just was told there's somewhere I gotta be in a little bit. We gotta go uh, get groceries and stuff. So I don't think I'll be able to actually get TSTG in this video. Um, because it requires blaster luck, and that could take hours and i just don't have the time to sit here and wait so i'm just going to teach you how to build the setup and yes it's 100 percent possible especially with all of these items um as far as i could tell you just need some good blaster luck um considering i've done life 20 tsdg i think not too long ago um, back when I did this 75 TSDG, I even tested like 10 and that's possible. It's just how good your luck is, but it's completely possible. I could guarantee the setup do, uh, does work, but it's just more or less, if there's any issues with it, you'll have to uh, fix that, but I don't know. I'm going to do my best here. It should be pretty easy because I am making this pretty foolproof so far, unlike the 75 one that was horrible that went horribly that entire thing um but yeah i just don't have time to sit here for that sorry um but all right so we're gonna get basic conveyor gate And then plasma conveyors. Actually, I don't know why I didn't just do this. And then it's 
See, just like that. Easy. Then, ramp. Oh my god. I don't know. I might actually just edit the video later and get a clip of me hoping for blaster luck. I don't know. We'll see what happens. Uh, just wait till the end of the video and I'll show um, clips later. I'll just go back and edit this video. Um, I guess, which shouldn't be too bad. But yeah, for now, we'll just build the setup and I'll come back in a few hours and record, I guess, the second part and just edit that in. That doesn't seem too bad, honestly. Shouldn't be too hard. Alright, now what I'm going to do here is put another lightning bolt. Because lightning bolt refiner is god tier. Um, I guess now I could put the gate with illuminator. Okay, I don't think I've ever been so pissed off in my life. Now, what happened was the recording at first stopped. Obviously, you could tell by the background. But then I I started building in the second take. Um, and my mic was muted and there was an echo uh, when I unmuted it. So, not only that, it just got... It just got really on my nerves. So this is all I've done. I've added in a lightning bolt predictor after the gate for the illuminator and three cryogenics and three um, uh, magma fires. I kept thinking of the molten upgrader the way up high, but that's not it. Um, One second. Sorry about that. Um, geez, um, oh yeah, then I put tiny conveyors, mini upgraders, a converter ramp with green tea latte, then just conveyor ramp system. And now over here, there is the three plasma iron polishers and a centering. Now, we're going to get a large conveyor ramp and a steamer. Now, then you're going to place a steamer every five units. Four of them. Now, the way this works is, it because of the centering conveyor at the very start, you and, uh, and these not being con converters, they don't push to the left, um, it'll just stay in the middle the whole time, and it pretty much won't die, because you can test it like this. See, they just stay there, so then you don't have to put a center and conveyor in front of each, because that would extend it by quite a lot, actually. All right, now we have to we have to put in our portables. So maybe maybe like right here. Perfect.
good spot. Here's another good one. Oh, that fits. And we'll be able to fit two on each side. Okay, only two left now. So not too bad. Um... That would... Probably not work still. Oh my. Does that? Too annoying. Otherwise I would. Oh wait, actually. If, okay, majority of these are fine. Like they're hitting. Nah. I don't want to take any chances, to be honest. Um, holy shit, dude. My cat is just freaking out right now. Then we're going to add in some decently hard to get items. Not really too bad. All right, now you want to make something like this. Honestly, this is pretty usable, I'd say. This does the job pretty well, in my opinion. Use about eight of these. As far as I know, these need like a certain value or something to work, but I used them last time and they don't do this. So, we'll be good. Don't worry about it right now. I'm just testing um, to get the ores, make sure they all go through correctly. Which is the main goal, because I don't want any screw-ups later on. Because I don't foolproof usually, but for this kind of thing, I definitely want to start doing that more. Now, we could do this. Okay, so that does need to be on fire. Okay. Okay. Because then if I take this away, okay, that's annoying, but whatever. Now what we're going to do is we are going to get out. Um, we're also going to put the music back on. Okay, thank you. Um, definitely not broken or anything. Okay, I think what I'm going to do is put in first a spore, because, you know, it's a spore. Two, just in case that does look a little bit risky. Or even better, I guess. Perfect. Now it'll always hit, no matter what. I think it was either way at the start. I just don't want this screwing up. It didn't look like it was going to hit every time. Um. These things are really, really good if you get lucky.
And now what we're gonna do is large conveyor ramp. And then we could put this Tesla and then this again. Dude, just stop dropping ores, dude. The hell? Oh, I turned off mines. I didn't even notice I turned off mines. I was like, wait, what? Alright. Um... Now, what we could do then is remove this. Then, always make sure that your raised mini conveyors are going the right way, by the way. Okay, that would have been horrible in some situation, I know that. Then, we're gonna use. Have we used any blue? We have not. And we could put blue here with We're gonna make this a bit more risky, but it'll take some testing. Okay, so screw the ore trackers. I don't want those in here. Just this. If this survives, that's god tier then. Because we need to make sure that it survives, no matter what. So I'm going to do some testing.
Alright, um... What was it I was thinking of doing next? Dude, this is... Oh my god, this is pushing me to my limits when it comes to low life. Alright, now, because I know if I just put a Tesla there to test this, it's just gonna wipe the status, and I don't want that to happen right now, because I need to make sure it'll survive to the furnace with the status. Um, is It's pretty much the whole point of this. Now, to test this, I could just put some basic conveyors, um, because they pretty much represent the same speed. Then, what you could do is get a Newtonium mine, or whatever mine you desire to use during this. Place it over here, um, or probably closer. And after that, you just wait, see if it works. If it survives majority of the time, you're fine. Um, if not, well, you're screwed. So yeah, this won't work, sadly. Um... Um, that actually is kind of sad. I was hoping that would work. Well, that's all right. I think that's slower than basic conveyors, to be honest. Yeah, Tesla is slow. Um, Alright, yeah, the setup seems to be done. Uh, I'll probably do the looping in the morning. I don't know, I just don't feel like doing that at the moment. Holy shit, this thing fits as a layout too? We did it, boys. Life 25 TSDG layout. Oh my god, I can't believe it. Okay, I'll see you guys in the morning. Peace out. Alright, good morning everyone. Um, Now, today, I'm going to finish this up. I'm going to see if this is possible. So, we're going to get our mine. We're going to actually get two Newtoniums just to speed this up for you guys. So then, you know, yeah. But you don't need to. Um, what you're going to do for your Newtonium is you're going to get two trackers, just like this. We're going to fill our ore limit here. Now, you want to set your quality all the way down. All the way. And we are going to let these loop till DE, and then we're going to send them in. Um... Make sure everything is correct. Make sure everything is working right. Um, because once you go in, it, it it's, it's it, pretty much. Um. Also, another suggestion I actually have that works very well is go into decor, get a slanted wall. And put it over here like this, because then, um, in case an ore tries to, like, fly out from the top, it's likely not gonna happen. Um, at least from that end. So, it does just help, it's not perfect. Um, obviously, as you could tell by this, it would be much more secure if you add two here, like that. That's much more secure, by far. But then again, you also have to remember, we do have the oversized conveyors. So, we're gonna be alright. It's just a matter of whether or not it's gonna fly out from the sides. So, what I'm gonna do is, you could look up DD in your inventory and buy a ladder. Um, and then put that right here. Just like that. It works as a wall. 
Um, let's buy a few of these. I'm just gonna put them around little spots. Like that. Once you have all your ores in, you can remove your trackers. Because you don't want any more ores going into the BBB loop. Um, you only want the ores that are that are good, uh, pretty much. There's still some worth the nillions, but pretty much majority are done. Um, all right, I'd say that's good enough. Now we're gonna we're gonna put this in here, but we're not gonna have our BBB going and just yet. Now we want these to spread out. That's the main goal here. Just get them to spread out as much as they can, not to sit in one area, because if they're sitting in one area, guess what's gonna happen when they explode? Oh shit. I messed that up. The one thing I didn't uh test is whether or not this was gonna work. Oh wait, actually, that's okay. Because I could save these really fast. Give me a second. I'm just going to put these back in here for a second. Oh my god. Yeah, they are all in one area right now. They need to spread out. Let me fix this really fast. Okay, yeah, so pretty much I just did this wrong. It's pretty easy to fix. Alright. So, I guess we're good to go. Um, the ores are quite spread out now i wouldn't say they're exactly perfect but you know it is what it is we're gonna need some extreme luck here i'm gonna be honest with you um really quick let me just Also, a good idea is to do this. Alright, now then we're going to get our BBV, and you want to put it right in the middle. Um, preferably towards these. You want to keep it away from open spots, but you also want to keep it to where the ores aren't just going to die of fire. So that's, like, the main thing you have to worry about, that the ores won't die from the fire. That's what makes these things really risky. Um. Alright, I'll see you when there are only a few ores. Alright, so there are now, like, three ores remaining. Um. Which is nice. Two. I think we're gonna keep two. Oh, shit, never mind. Okay, now what we are going to do is first, we're going to go spam click this. We have to. We're going to come over here. We're going to get a pink teleporter. We're going to hope for the best, boys. Now, this is literally every upgrader in the game that I could use as far as my knowledge uh, goes right now, honestly. Um... Alright, so the ore straight up just died the minute it went in, so gotta hope for the best this run. Alright, hopefully we could actually get two ores this time, like I wanted. Uh, right here. Oh, man. 
This is gonna take so much RNG. I know it will. This is gonna be insane to watch, my guy. We have to make- we have to pretty much make sure that they make it through these, though, because if they make it through these, we're- we're good. Um, especially if both do, because then we'll have four ores. Um, and also we have to make sure it doesn't die from the third lightning bolt, but we're gonna need to do it either way, so. Not only is there a BBB loot, there's tons of other RNG aspects right now, and it's just- it's a lot, dude. We have some pretty good ores, though. Uh, we have QND ores and QDD ores, so I'd say we're doing pretty good right now on ores. Oh shit, I could've killed an ore. Um, two QND, 90 QND, I'm pretty sure I just saw. 45, 10, 4, 1, 1, 26, 30, 100, 28, 288? Oh my god. These ores are great. Yeah, we're definitely gonna need some heavy RNG. SXD, come on. Come on, come on, come on. You can make it. One more suffix, please. Sixty S sixty, come on. Let's count how many ores there are. Uh two five. There's five ores right now. SPD, come on. Please an OCD ore. Oh my god, that would be so nice. Three. All right. One more death. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay, I need to follow and see where this ore dies. Go, 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 come on. Okay, I'll... Oh, does it die there? One second. Okay, great. I didn't know that it would just kill the ore, which is absolutely stupid in my opinion, because you need to make sure it hits. So, yay. Alright, time to loop again. Here... Alright, I'm back. I had to do some stuff for the 100k UC giveaway in MHD. Um... Oh no 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 Oh my god, that was so close! Okay, they were all gonna like clog up against the wall and I don't want that happening. Um... Either way though, so far so good. Now that I've fixed that, we should be all good. This should be the run. Um, I will see you guys, though, after this. Uh, be right back. Oh my god, this is a horrible round when it comes to luck. So far, uh, we only have, like, 30 ores left, and they're only 
E and Q N or Q D D, not Q N D, not even Q N D yet. Um, what I decided to do was add in a fourth lightning bolt and hope for the best there because honestly, I think maybe that could save us and get us the T S D G uh, setup that we need. But yeah, uh, either way. This is so luck based, and I'm tired of looping. I've been doing this for probably about two hours now. Um, and I just haven't gotten anything, so. But yeah, we'll get really close, I know that. Uh, I know this setup is definitely capable of getting TSDG, it's not like it's impossible or something, but, you know. It's more or less just the challenge of why, but, you know, it's, it's doable, easily. DE going into a BB B loop is plenty. Um, I'm hoping for at least an SXD or or else we're kinda screwed. Just naturally, uh, based off how this works. Um, we're at least minimum needing SXD. That is just a fact at this point. But, you know. QND. The first run or no, the run before this I had was so clean. It, it lasted so long. Everything went perfect. But I guess now things are changing. But I don't know. We'll see. Um, maybe we could get a little bit of luck out of this. But I don't know. We're just gonna have. To, we're just gonna have to hope for the best, my guy. Currently we have uh, six ores, so not too bad. I'm definitely a little unsatisfied with that, though. Come on, SXD. Four ores now. Don't drop to two, please. Don't drop to two, please. Come on, one last ore can die, and then I'm I'm done. Okay. So I guess we did not get spd but we got sxd um which is pretty decent uh we got medium uh sxd didn't get a lot but that's all right okay so the ore should survive now spd ocd come on we're doing good so far NVD, come on, good, good, come on, please hit, please hit correctly, BGN, that most certain, Be closed, be closed. Okay, good. I always, like, I don't know, the way it's not fully, um, like, transparent, but it kind of is, I don't know, it bugs me sometimes. I always feel like, yeah, this is not gonna go good at all. Um, we're at UVG right now, so this is actually really, really promising. And I don't know what to say about it. Honestly, like this is a really promising run so far. DVG, come on. TVG. Okay, that killed it. Um, come on, please do your thing. I'm gonna cry, my, my guy. I'm gonna cry. I'm not lightning bolt this time. I just need this to work. SPG. 
Come on. Super close. OVG. Oh my god, I know the Schrodinger is not gonna treat me well. Oh shit, wait. Oh, this is bad. I heard it's best to replace them. Uh, not too long ago, so I'm gonna do that. PGN, come on. Please. Please, please, dude. No! Alright, so now it is um up to luck. And we're gonna need a lot of it. So I'm gonna try my, my BBB trick I usually do. Um, this works a lot of the time to not kill off ores in rapid successions. You do this for 10 times, maybe, and then you're good. Oh, shit. Yeah, I did not want those ores then. Because now we're gonna have really bad ores. Some of them. There's a chance it could be one of those that makes it out. It's just a really shitty ore. Um, okay, so based off my match ribbons so far, we're gonna need at least... Um... At least... SPD. If we don't get SPD, we're done. It's It's not gonna happen. Um, because it's solely going to rely on, uh, BBB luck at this point, and how many times you actually use the lightning bolt. Now, there's a chance that if that ore that died from this lightning bolt was really really good if it didn't die there's a chance we could have gotten tsdg or maybe dtg but um i don't think we would have gotten tsdg uh honestly we're getting close uh we're only two suffixes off which is all right um i'd say that's pretty good for the first time the ore actually got to the furnace but now we have to solely rely on the BBB because I know we're going to need some really, really good ores. And that's hard to promise, I guess. Um, but, you know, it is what it is. And then the random ores just got in, and I hate that because it's just kind of reducing your chances. But it's all good. Yeah, these are only at like TDD, QDD, QND maybe. Um, I don't really know so far, but all right, I'll see you in a few. All right. Um, it's just a matter of hoping these ores are good. I'm very nervous right now, but we have to make sure these survive. Alright, go, 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 go. Oh god, that one almost died. Dude, I hate how much risk is involved in this. Like, I wish this was just easy. But, it's obviously not. Like, to some extent, this is barely possible. Um, which is 
a definite yes but oh shit wait no 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 click 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 go go oh my god all right that's fine we'll just click this one in the back um spam Okay. Come on. These words better be good. Oh shit. Come on. Oh no 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 no. It's not worth it. These ones, yes. Shit. No, I can make it. Okay. I don't think this one will be the run, but it could be. Is more or less just hoping for that. Nor died. We got one or boys. Come on. Please, 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 please. Come on, Ori, you got this. We're screwed. Come on. Dude, I am... <sighs> no, I think just because it's a bit better, um, I'm just going to shorten it down to this. But yeah. Alright, because I don't think anyone wants to watch me loop, I'm just going to do this myself. Alright, so I'm keeping that there. This can finally come up here, and then these will kind of all just be together. So, okay. All right, see you in a little while. All right, so I did my loop, and I probably had some of the best luck I've had in ages. I got OCD. And NVD. Like, I am in shock at how good these ores actually are. So, we're going to kind of praise these ores because these are guaranteed TSDG. We've, we've done it, boys. Watch this. NVD. VGN already. This ore is not too good, but it's still, it's still all right. A suffix or two behind. Or ahead. I don't know which one's ahead. Uh, I think this one's actually ahead. I don't know. I'm not really paying too much attention to it. Yeah, this one's ahead. The one in the back. But either way, this or is insane. Oh my god. I don't know how my luck was actually that high, but it is what it is. Now, it's the end of the day. All I'm going to say is, holy shit, because I have no idea how that only took me three attempts to get good ores. That, that took me about three, four attempts to get good ores, and 
I'm shocked at how good they actually were. I have to replace these. Um... I would say someone reminded me to do it, but... That's not gonna... Oh, no. Oh, that's... That's rough. Come on. You know what? I don't think I'm going to use the BB... Or not the BBB, the, the lightning bolts. Why did I say BBB? Um... I don't know. We'll see what happens with this, honestly. Um... Come on. Come on. This is... This is rough. Oh my god. Oh my god, boys. Oh my god. Why? Hey, dude. Alright, we still have an ore here. We still have an ore here. That was that was TSDG right there. That was TSDG. And it just got swept away from us. But okay. I see how this game is, dude. I'm gonna fucking cry. Alright guys, so I got more good ores. Um, actually, what I'm gonna do really quick, just to make this easier, um, is this. Just presets to swap from. And then I will put ancient conveyors all along here. Just loading up BBB, just in case. Uh, so we have OCD. OCD and high OCD. So we're gonna get some really good luck this run, is what I'm hoping. NVD. That last ore, oh my god, that ore is good. It's already high VGN. Alright, uh, is it closed? Okay, we're waiting for about three ores to go through. One. Holy shit, DVG? Already? I gotta eat dinner in a second. Uh, let me do this real quick. We have so many good ores, dude. This is it. Alright, so we managed to do it. Uh, see you guys. I don't have a lot of time on me, so, yep.